Right, welcome to another one of our videos from Ictus Ruffle in the Corres where my son Danny is a bailiff, head bailiff manages um, Ruffle since last year uh, I've got 72 hours, I'm on, on Swim J conditions are not great, it's, uh, the sun, it's nice and sunny but I've got a north northeasterly wind it's not ideal fishing conditions but that's going to change tomorrow or the day after so that swing round to south south westerly that could be better then but we'll see how we get on lovely venue i've been here oh three times now since last year since danny's been running uh, the, the lake uh, came in christmas and i came again in, i think it was may or june i can't remember but if you're already subscribed to our channel there's um three or four videos of ictus ruffle and ictus down at pool um, already saw our, saw our channel so if you're subscribed you'll be able to find them on the on the channel if not please subscribe to our channel and um, like the video and leave any comments okay donc uh, voilà je suis à Ictus Rufu uh, pour 72 heures je suis post J donc uh, J pour Jennifer quoi on va voir qu'est-ce que ça donne. C'est le météo n'est pas top ça. C'est très très beau, mais c'est un vent de nord nord-est donc. Mais ça change demain ou après-demain donc euh, on verra pour la suite. Mais bon, c'est vraiment un étang magnifique. Ça fait mes troisième fois que j'ai visité euh, Rufou. Une fois euh, en décembre, Noël, l'année dernière. Et puis euh, fin mai ou juin, euh, et, et maintenant c'est mes troisième visite. Et c'est mon fils qui gère les temps, Danny. Donc euh, c'est vraiment magnifique. Des très très beaux poissons. Donc on verra si on peut prendre quelques-unes. Right. I'm going to get my rod set. Get everything set up. And let's see how we get on. I think the, the approach is going to be to fish very light, you know, I'm only going to fish just a handful of sweet corn with um, um, maybe um, curved shank rigs with some fake maize, two or three pieces of fake maize. That's, I think, all it really needs. I've got a bit of um, hemp with me. I've got some boilies. I'm going to put one rod out on, on boilies because you never know. Um, but the rest I'm going to fish just very light, you know, see how we get on. We fished very well last week, there was four or five fifties at. Oh, uh, fingers crossed, could be good. Don't. On either. Right, I've got three rods going down in the bay, into, into K. One over there by that bush, which is really my banker rod. Got another one down there somewhere, and another one over there to the right. Don't give me two can lava. Don't look don't cay. Don't obey the cay. Ca, pardon. Je pose une can là. La deuxième là. Et la troisième là. Là, je pêche avec le four maize. Ou juste un petit peu maïs douce. Euh... C'est tout. Ça fait ces trois cannes là. Là-bas, je ne vais pas pêcher pour l'instant, mais j'ai amorcé euh, avec des bouillettes. Et ma quatrième canne, elle est là. Et là, je pêche juste sous la gauche de ce euh, marqueur là. Là, j'ai morcé avec des bouillettes aussi. So, yeah, guys, that's me, me fourth rod, which is fishing out to the left of the swim, which goes through that channel and into swim I H. And the VIP swim down into the bay where F is. 
and then it swings around at the bottom going down towards the island so hopefully I might in intercept a few fish coming in and out of this channel see actually that's the narrowest part of the lake just there so it's always a good bet normally but we'll see absolutely fantastic swim you can get three anglers on this swim but là en face ça fait uh, le bay de L c'est très joli par là c'est où j'ai fait des deuxièmes vidéos en juin et là sur la droite ça c'est cas sur la L tu vois juste euh, juste l'entrée quoi right I'm fishing just got to catch him now hopefully next time I see you it'll be a nice big carp Stacks and stacks of room, beaucoup beaucoup place. Huh? Et un petit vélo. <laughs> sympa, très sympa. You get a bike in this swim also. Going back to the um, toilets and showers. This is not too far. Actually. I'm walking it actually. I'm not taking a bike. First time I fished this swim, so I don't know it too well. But then he's giving me some pointers. This probably means I'm going to blank. <laughs> Only joking, son. <laughs> right, let's see if we can catch some. Here you go, first fish of the session. Sunday dinner time, 30th of September now. This one's gone 24 and a half pound. Nice little common, taken over on the far bank. And voilà, dimanche matin, uh, dimanche midi, 30 septembre. And the commune de bah, 24 livres, 11 kilos. Avec euh, des cordeurs euh, pour maize. Mais c'est un bon départ, joli poisson. Je vais te montrer de l'autre côté. On va vous montrer de l'autre côté. Je vais vous montrer de l'autre côté. Je vais Another one. Good start. See you another time. Ooh. Right, not a big fish, but I thought I'd show you him because he's the first one I caught at night. 22 and a half pound. Donc, euh, pas un gros poisson, euh, 10, 10 kilos, mais le premier poisson que j'ai pris de la nuit, il est 1h du matin. Donc voilà. Le premier poisson de la nuit. First fish of the night. Right, I'll swoop around. I'll show you the other side. 
I honestly didn't think I was going to get a bite during the night. <laughs> Lovely autumn colours, really. Lovely fish. I don't know where it's going to come out in there. With the lighting, but... There you go. 22 pound. Let's slip her back. And who knows, we might get another one tonight. Well, I can make a law. It's probably a hundred pendant la nuit. C'est un petit jeu en premier, donc c'est bien. Voilà. Great fishing, isn't it? Right. Definitely a cup of tea. Whew, one o'clock in the morning. Right, let's get this one back. After that little one last night, that 22 pounder, I had another run at five o'clock this morning, which unfortunately come off. Um, then it went a bit quiet. I've just had another one, a really nice mirror, 37 pounds. She's sitting down there in the, in the sling. So I'm gonna get her up and I'll show you. Lovely fish, really nice and fat, beautiful fish. Donc, uh, depuis cette uh, miroir, pendant la nuit, deux heures, je un décroche à 5h ce matin. Après ça, c'était un peu calme. À 9h, ça déroule ce matin à droite, toujours avec les fourmis. Et c'est une belle miroir de 16 kg. Donc euh, voilà, je vais te montrer ça. Let's go and get her out. And I'll show you. She's a little bit angry. What a lovely fish, 37 pound. Again, out on the, uh, the fake maze. Seems to be doing the job. Nothing out on the boilies. Really slow. I don't have a run out there yet. That's all it needs. Three weeks of fake maze. A couple of handfuls of sweet corn. A bit of hemp. And that's doing the trick. En voilà. Belle miroir de 16 kg. Toujours avec les four maize. Sur ma canne à droite. Très joli poisson. Wow. Après la décroche, euh, le décroche à 5 heures, j'étais un peu déçu parce que c'était les premiers décroches. Après ce matin, 9h, 9h30, ça de rouler. Même spot. Biggest one so far. There you go. There's the other side of it. Look at that big scale up there. What a fish. Awesome. Right, let's get her back and sit out in the sun. The weather's much better today. South South West City winds 26, 27, so it's going to be nice and warm. Hopefully, I'll get a few more. Donc voilà, le météo est beaucoup mieux aujourd'hui, sud sud west. Donc il fait très beau, 25, 26. Donc uh, peut-être uh, quelques unes. Uh, on the journey. Oh, voilà. Let's get her back. Set in the sun. Quel poisson. Magnifique. Merci, baby. Thank you very much, Gil. Let's get her back. Fish number five, 32 pound common. Lovely fish, look, mint condition again. Absolutely beautiful. Voilà, une commune de 32 livres, 14 et demi. Toujours avec les fourmis de chez Corder. 
quel joli poisson, magnifique, regarde ça, what a fish. Et il y a voilà, l'autre côté. Très content. C'est bien la pêche. Hein? Ben voilà, on remet à l'eau. Si on peut tenter euh, un plus gros. Let's get it back. See if we can get another one. But we're happy. Five fish now. Get her back. A cup of tea. See if we get another one. Right, it's Monday, about 11 o'clock now. Had a couple of small ones during the night. Little mirror about 14, 15 pounds, which I just let go. And a little koi, which I took, I didn't do a video of it, but I've taken a couple of photographs, so. I'll, I'll, put, I'll put them on the video somewhere along the line. But I've just had, a, just had a run, a really nice looking fish, nice scaly one. And it's gone just under, just under 24 pound. Donc euh, pendant la nuit, j'ai deux, deux, deux petits poissons, un petit miroir de 5-6 kilos que j'ai relâché tout de suite, et un petit koi. Donc euh, les koi, c'était oh, 5-6 kilos aussi, mais j'ai pris quelques photos, pas de vidéo. Mais je vais mettre des photos euh, tout à l'heure. Mais là, je viens de prendre un, un bel, bel miroir, encore un petit, de bah, 11,5 kg. Mais c'est un joli poisson, encore avec des faux maïs. Jeez. How about that? Stunning little fish. Quel joli poisson. Magnifique. Regarde les écailles. Those, look at those scales. Absolutely stunning fish. Just under 23 pound. Let's show you the other side. We'll let this one go. How about that? There's the other side of her. Beautiful fish. Just under 23 pound. Right, let's get this little baby back. The rod's out, actually, I got the rod back out. And a uh, quick cup of tea. See if we get another one. But to be honest with you, I don't mind catching these all day long. Look at that. What a peach. Oh voila, I can make Go on, baby, off you go. Thank you very much. That's it, end of the session. Didn't have nothing last, last night, nothing this morning. So I finished up with seven fish, biggest 38 pound. Really enjoyed the session, a bit slow, but did well anyway. 
Right, if you like this sort of video, please don't forget to subscribe to the channel, like the video, and if you've got any comments, please please leave them underneath and I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you're interested in booking Ictus Ruffle, I'll leave a little bit of information at the end of this video where you can um, where you can book and all the information you need. Right, thanks for watching the video, I hope you've enjoyed it, and I'll see you again next time. Bah voilà les amis, uh, pas de poisson pendant la nuit, la session est finie. Donc j'ai fini avec 7 poissons, jusqu'à 16 kilos. Donc un peu difficile au départ, mais plusieurs poissons quand même. Beaucoup aimé euh, cette session. Donc voilà, n'oubliez pas d'abonner si vous n'avez pas abonné déjà. Et aimez la vidéo. Et bien sûr, laissez vos commentaires en bas. On va reprendre euh, le plus vite que possible. Donc voilà les amis. A bientôt. See you again next time.